Hi, this is Aprajita from Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. In this video, we will learn how to enable a secure connection between MPP and application server so that the applications configured are configured using HTTPS protocol. Let us begin this exercise by logging into Experience Portal Manager's Web Administration Access. We will use username as admin and its respective password as a password. Click on log on. This is the home page of Experience Portal Manager server. A prerequisite for this exercise is that the security certificates must be exchanged between the EPM server and the application server prior to this. Go to MPP servers under system configurations now. This opens up MPP servers web page. This page displays the list of all the MPP servers configured for this EPM. And down there are different settings that can be changed. And these settings are common amongst all the MPPs configured for this server. Let's click on browser settings here. This is browser settings web page. Different parameters are available here which can be configured by us but this will impact all the MPPs configured for this EPM server. If we scroll down on this page, we have a parameter called SSL verify under INET. This is what we need to enable to enable the secure connection between the MPP and application server. Click on save to save the changes. Once the changes are saved, we come back to the MPP server web page. And we get a confirmation message saying the information entered has been saved. And at the same time, we see a warning message which says that you must restart all the MPPs before the changes will take effect. So go to MPP Manager under System Management. Now this page shows all the MPPs configured for this server. Click on the MPP available here. This enables the commands that can be applied on this MPP server. Click on restart as we want to restart the MPP. Now if you look at the active command, it says it's restarting. It takes a while to restart the MPP server. In case there are multiple MPPs configured, it is suggested that you restart MPPs one by one. Let us refresh this page. The state changed to stopping. This page automatically gets refreshed for any changes on the MPP manager side on a periodic basis. But you can force a refresh by clicking on this button available on the right hand side of this web page. Now the state is shown as stopped. We have to wait till the time it becomes running again. If you look at the state now, it's running. So we are good now. Go back to Applications page under System Configuration. Now we are all set to configure our application using HTTPS URL for the application server configured. So this completes our demonstration. Thank you for your time today. For any questions, comments or feedback, Please write to mentor at avaya.com or follow us on Twitter at avaya mentor. Thank you for choosing avaya.